Hey guys, thank you for subbing and liking and sharing and commenting, guys. I really love it and appreciate it. I love, and uh, I just had a thought I wanted to quickly share <clears throat> about what we're doing here on this planet. Oh, look, the sun came out. That's nice. I bought this little plant from the store so I could give myself a garden in this freezing cold place. And um, so uh, the word I want to focus on is integrity. Integrity. We have to bring, we're here to bring some integrity back to the planet, which has been taken over by demons and, and basically uh, used, <clears throat> abused, loosed on, sold. I mean, you know, it, it, it's very hard for us to believe that we as a species are not being farmed exactly the same way that we farm our farm animals. But it is true, Sally, Sally. And it is real. Yes, indeed. A prison planet and also a farm and a pharmacy. Pharmaceuticals. Farm, pharma, pharmaceuticals. Why? Because it turns out, amazingly so, that the human body has all and everything you could possibly want to nurture yourself, rejuvenate yourself, rebuild yourself, heal yourself, make your skin look gorgeous. Mm. You know how those reptilian queens are. They like to stay young forever on human louche. Tortured children's got the best taste for them. They like that taste. Um... Yes, our children are being sold and eaten and raped and um, turned into health juice for weirdo queens on other planets, okay? Far out, <laughs> get over it. Time to grow up and expand our consciousness, people. I know it's tough, but we can do it. We can do it. Yes, you can. And you shall, and you are, and you will, and you're doing a good job, okay? You're doing a good job. You're doing it, guys. So, while we're here on Earth, in our human, magic human body that has gold flecks in it, by the way, guys. The real humans, okay? R the originals, the original blood, which is either, I don't know if it's O positive or A negative. I don't know. There's something, uh, I think the A's are either Aldebaran or they're the, I don't know, but everybody I know with A blood or the A negatives anyway, are good, very good. My mother and I are in the A negative. We're very good. And we're, and we're star beings, but with earth code, mother earth codes, ancient mother earth codes. Um, I believe that Summer Wells, her soul, her spirit, I think that it's possible she was one of those moon goddesses, the, the high spirits. And when you murder, or as Simon Pox would say, when you spill the blood of a moon goddess, it is a big fucking deal. You don't just kill a moon goddess, guys. You get the soul. You got to trap the soul. You got to attract it to its genetics. Now, the wells and the blinds got a long history of family line. Bad guys coming from, I believe that Captain Blythe probably came over from England like the rest of us white people on in America, right? Or white people in America. The original, the originales were the American Indians, right? Now, not all Indians were nice. There were this badass group of, of Indians that were killers, man. And everybody was afraid of these, a fear to these guys, including the nice Indians, because there were nice Indian tribes. And then there was this one really badass tribe, the famous, I don't know if it was the Cherokee or the famous, that famous tribe that was really, really a badass Indian tribe. And they're the ones that would scalp you, which is really fucking gruesome. If you think about it, that scalping is fucking disgusting. Why would they take your scalp? It's just, ugh, ugh. Oh, God, there's just so many horrible things, you know. I think we need a break. We need to bring back some integrity. Now, how do we do this? This is our job. This is what we got to think about now, the word integrity, integrity. You know, values, you know, values. Let's talk about values. 
Like on Manimal's channel the other night, he was like, there was some bad shit going on. And he was like, but we can't allow this. Let's talk about values. And what they're trying to do is change our values so we don't care about killings. And we don't care about child abuse. And we, how many people are now ki killing their kids and their, their spouses and they don't want children? Would they sell them? Yes. Well, of course they would. Come on. Obviously. Now, let me ask you this. If you had 10 guys helping to sell a child and everybody gets a cut, right? 10. 10 guys. Okay? Say the child cost 100000 So 10 guys, they each get $10,000. You think they're going to fucking do it for 10000 Damn straight they are. That's a lot of fucking money. Would they do it for 1000 Probably. Especially if they didn't really know what they were doing. They just got to pick up this, bring her to that. It's like, you know, many hands make light work, busy work. It's like, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just picking up this, driving them there. I mean, you know what I'm saying? You can hide things. This is a, this was well planned in my opinion. Not enough money? Bullshit. There's big fucking money in kids. This is something to educate yourselves on. To say that there's no money in babies is so stupid. I'm sorry, but there's big money in children, especially five-year-olds. She's not a baby at that point. She's a fuckable little child. Sorry to say it so crudely and rudely. I'm crude and rude sometimes. A, from my dad. B, from partially my mom. And C, from hanging around with Jimmy all the time. I'm crude and rude, okay? But I'm still good. I still got a big heart. I'm still here to bring some integrity to the planet with you guys, the team, our team, okay? We're all in this together, right? You know what I really liked about Jimmy on his show the other night? He gives away stuff, and then they're all giving to each other. It was so nice. I was like, wow, this is human. This is the human stuff. Where he, he, you know, we play a little game. Somebody wins something, and then they're like, you know, I want to send it to this person. And there's a gift of love, another gift, giving, giving, sharing, paying it forward, right? It was really sweet and beautiful. I was like, oh, man, here's Jimmy, my rough and tough Jimmy. I used to call him Crustacean Jimmy because he was like a tough crab after being in the cave for, cave for 15 years. Back, This is back then in the old life, that one life. And I was like, he was tough as nails. He kind of He kind of got cold and crusty, you know, because he had to be because he was hanging out with crabs and he had to be, and he had to be tough to survive. And he did survive. And he had to be really, 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 really tough. And he had to do some very, very hard things to get to survive and wait for us, for me to come back and get him, which he knew I would. And I did do, I did get him. And then I never left him. That's why I can't take my eyes off him. Whenever he's there, I'm like, I can't, I'm like, I got, I'm like, it's so funny because I, I know so many people and I love all these people, but it's like, as soon as Jimmy came along, it was just completely hyper-focused onto the one guy. Cause I feel like if I can get the one guy, the one guy who's an important old ancient soul, the real player to be, to get his love codes going more than his crab codes. If I can get him awaken up, baby, what are we doing here? You know, remember, remember, ding, 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 right? Get his love codes going. Get his human codes activated. Get him in charge. Get his magic skills doing good. You can hurt with your voice. You got the voice codes that create. They can destroy. You can create or you can destroy with your same freaking voice. How are you going to use it? Let's do the love code thing. Let's do the right thing this time. You know? We gotta. Gotta, 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 gotta. Let's do the love code, human code, integrity, value, good value system thing. Now, Jimmy was pissed at Dave because I think, I was just remembering it all. Dave had every, because Dave like married the princess or something. He he got in with the king and the royal, you know, um, he got lucky. But I mean, he, he's also here to do a job, but he's doing his job. He's doing his job doing the team, the team systems busters fix the planet thing. And then Jimmy's, but Jimmy back, he's like, oh man, that fucker, got all, he got everything. He got the princess, he got the fucking castle, he's got all the fucking robes and velvet and gold and all that shit. Jimmy was stuck out in the goddamn cave for 15, 16 fucking years, you know? And Dave gets all this shit. And he just was so fucking pissed at Dave. <laughs> Dave always gets the girls, you know, and it was just like, dude, what's he gonna, you would too, you would too, if you were Dave, you would too marry the princess and live in the fucking castle and schmooze up to the king, I mean, he, he, it was part of his job, you know, 
And um, it's always been tough to remember what we're doing because they take away your memory. So it's really been a tough job, guys. Don't think, you know, it's it, it's never been easy. It's always been tough. It's really hard. It's very, very, it's almost impossible. I can't believe we're, we're pulling this shit off, honestly. And we are. And we have done and we will do and we are doing. That's it. We're doing it. God damn it. We're doing it. Arr. So I think Summer Wells, it's possible. I, I learned about this whole soul thing from Simon Parks and others. Everybody, really, in the truth or community. That's more of a community. I don't know if that's a community. The crime community is not a community. <laughs> it's just a bunch of crazy people focusing on, I don't know. It's just, we're, we're all one community, if you think about it. But I don't, I don't see, I don't see true crime as a community. I guess it sort of is. You meet people. I mean, Jimmy's, Jimmy's little, his channel is like, his world is a community. That's a community. I'm like, yeah, that's a damn community. Um, country singers, that's a community. Or like, you know truther community conspiracy people whatever i guess that's a community that's my favorite kind of people i like the thinkers i like the questioners i like the ones who are going what am i fucking doing here because those are the ones that are doing the job the real work the tough work we got to support each other it's not easy um and so it's like damn if i can get jimmy you know to get really into his warm loving human codes after all he's been through which is pretty some tough stuff then we then we're gonna be okay you know then we're gonna be all right then we're gonna be all right we're gonna be all right right it's all on jimmy and his world because he affects so many people so it's like people who affect a lot of people and he'll, he's gonna affect even more people uh once he gets back on truth or track which he can do because those he has to that's gotta be, gotta be deep down in the, in the depth, in the center of your spine, connected to the center of your soul, connected to the center of earth, connected to the center of the neutral, the quantum, the Q, the, the, um, original point, center point. Ha! You go into the center point and you create from there. You recreate. Okay. You co-create, you co-recreate, you fix it, you fix it with your, in with your wisdom codes and your earth codes and your loving intelligence codes. Because this earth, this planet, which is very tiny, sparkly little light, got everything you need. And who controls it controls everything. That's why they're fighting over it. But we's going to win, okay? We's going to win. Who's we? You know who we are. The original code makers. But are we also the code breakers? Breakers, yeah, but we only break the bad codes. So we're the original code makers. That just came to me. So we are the ones, okay? And we cannot neglect these issues anymore. No more cold cases. I mean, I can see that they think they want Summer Wells to go into cold case like the older sister did. I don't think that's going to happen the same way. They want it to. They expect it to. They're trying to make it go cold. Uh, but hopefully, I, I saw Molly go lightly. She wasn't even talking about it at all. I mean, her she's totally changed. I'm on a completely different timeline, by the way. Totally different timeline. I haven't seen Jimmy yet. So I don't know. I don't know what he seems like on this timeline. Does he wear black? Does he wear white? Does he wear blue or red or green? What does he wear? He doesn't wear green much. Maybe he'll wear green. Uh, he doesn't usually wear green. Green screen. Maybe it disappears. Um... But yeah, it's sort of like that in my crazy mind. Now, I have been damaged to a point where I almost am not the same. The, the, my old structures are gone. I'm recreating. So I see Jimmy. I'm like, oh, my God, one of the original players. Just focus on him. He's, you know, focus on the real player here. I mean, I can't take all this bullshit anymore. You know, get him on track and we're going to be OK. We're going to be I, you know. All right. Love you. Love you, love you, love you. Earth codes, human codes, integrity and values. It matters. And we are doing it and we will do it. And we're doing it now and you've been doing it and you're doing a great job. Thank you. Thank you for your service, guys. Keep going. Don't let it slide. Keep focused. Yay. Love you. I'll be back waiting for 448. Big kiss.